Hello, my name is Mike and I'm part of the customer success team here at Outfield. Today, we will cover the various ways you can track customer touch points with Outfield. No matter how simple or complex your outside sales operations are, keeping in contact with your customer base is priority number one. Knowing where a potential sale is within the customer journey can help you move it through your pipeline to an eventual close. Having touchpoint data on hand makes it easier to justify changes to your team, changes that will lead to more sales and higher conversion rates. For each way Outfield captures customer touchpoints, we'll see how Doug, a field sales rep, uses the data to his advantage. The first method is with the Team Activity page. The Team Activity page contains several useful tools for customer touchpoint analysis. You can scroll through the feed and view customer engagements at a low level with general notes and pictures as well as timestamps and visit duration. For a deeper look into a specific activity, clicking Details will show you the form results from that check-in. Atop the Team Activity page, you'll notice a large map populated with clusters and pins. This map shows all of your team's activity from a geographic standpoint. Turn on the heat map and you'll see where your team is allocating their resources. Red areas indicate a high level activity and green areas point to less interactions. Doug can look at this map to see where he spends the majority of his time, as well as areas that are being underserved. He may think about exploring a new territory and finding new customers. To see specific visits, use the filters to show activities by form, type, team member, and time frame. For example, if Doug wants to see all of his needs analysis visits for the month of March, Outfield has his back. These filters transfer over to everything from the feed, to the map, to reporting, which brings up the next way you can view customer touchpoints, generating reports. From the team activity page, clicking generate report will craft up a professionally styled PDF report where you can find insights like field rep activity numbers, customer specific touchpoints, and a list of all interactions that fall within your set filters. Here, we can see that Doug is averaging an hour and a half for each visit. Maybe he needs to speed things up a little bit to hit his target of 45 minutes per visit. You can have these reports automatically generated on a daily, weekly, or monthly basis from the settings page. Just include your email address and how often you want to receive summary reports. Another place you can track your touch points is from the accounts page. From there, you can colorize the map by last check-in to see what locations have been visited most recently as well as locations that haven't been serviced in a while. This could highlight locations that are being ignored and could stand to benefit from having an outside sales rep plan a visit. The colorize feature doesn't stop there. You can also segment your map by deal stage. On this map, we can see that Doug is having a hard time moving his proposals to close deals in his Texas territory. Doug can reflect on these accounts and see if there's anything he can change to start converting those proposals into sales. Finally, if you want to view your touch points in a way that allows you to crunch the numbers, you can always export your data to an Excel file. From the Import Export page, just select what you want included, and in a few seconds you'll have an easy to work with file for customer touch point analysis. Here, we can see that Doug has exported his activity and built an advanced metrics module where he can see the ROI of each visit. Data like this lets him know how effective he's being with his time. Outfield provides a toolbox full of ways to track customer touch points. Utilize these tools to manage accounts better and make data-driven changes to your sales strategy. Track your touch points today and experience the field reimagined.